Hello everybody, this is Octavius Woman Zero giving you a gameplay. What else could it be? I mean, of course I'm doing a gameplay. And today I wanted to talk about the next Call of Duty. Are you really going to get it? I mean, when you think about it, all the other Call of Duties, they've been the same since from Call of COD 4. And I've played it like at my friend's house. I don't necessarily own the game. I own the game from Modern Warfare 2 to Call of Duty Black Ops 2 now. Are you, are you seriously going to buy it? I mean, because when you think about it, it's the, it's been the same old thing. It, it's just been going down south for me, the whole Call of Duty series. I mean, I think the, the best one so far has been probably um, COD 4 and um, World at War. Those, are, those have been, like, probably the best CODs. And why is that? Well, because they were different at the time, but now we're used to the same old thing, the same old hit markers, the same hold, the same hold, the same thing. Basically, I can't really really explain it. It's just been similar, not not like graphics, but like similar gameplay, similar hit markers, and even though Ghost they're, they're, they decided to create a new server, you don't know what that new server is gonna be, and what if it's worse than the new Call of? What if it's worse than the older Call of Duties? Well, I guess you don't really know unless you buy it. So, yes, I will be buying COD, um, COD, um, Ghost, just cause I wanna, I wanna know what it's like. I wanna know the experience. I wanna know if whether it's better or not. I, I mean, I, more. It's just for me, it's more of an experiment. I guess for a lot of people, it's gonna be a, an experiment as well because it's a whole new engine, a whole new everything, basically. But. Depending upon how COD Ghost goes, Call of Duty Ghost, if you want to say it like that, I might just get Call of Duty just for zombies. I mean, the past, the past DLC, um, what is it? The past DLC, man, I'm just stuttering right now. Well, the past DLC, it, it's just been so fun. Now, the one before that, Revolution, Revolution, I did, I didn't like that. I thought that DLC was really just a waste of time. And how did I not die? That was crazy. I mean, I was like so excited about that. But really, the uprising, that new DLC, Mob of the Dead. I have been playing that constantly. I mean, I, 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 I had to get off of it for a moment because I was just having so much fun. And today I was playing it. I got the free. Um, I got the free Blunder Gat, the Acid Gat, the the Hell's Redeemer. I got so much stuff. The Golden Spork. And I will be posting the Zombies gameplay. Just don't know when, but I will be posting one soon. Very soon. Maybe I may even work on it tonight with a couple of my buddies. But yeah, that's pretty much it about the whole Ghost thing. I, I'm getting it as an experiment. And I'm going to try to be as unbiased as possible. Because I'm just getting bored of it. Now this gameplay, I went 26-0. and 0, And this was actually my first flawless gameplay. I was actually doing pretty good. I really don't know what to talk about now. Guess all you can do is really watch it. Huh, let me think. What can I talk about? Oh, yeah. Shoutouts. So, for my last video, I did say about topics. And I decided that there will be one that I'm including. And that one is going to be um, shoutouts. I decided to give people shoutouts because I want other YouTubers to know that, hey, even though you're starting off low, like you started from the bottom, now you, you do not want to hear that song, I know you don't. Like, we all start off basically zero subscribers from the bottom. And as your as your um, channel improves and you keep posting videos, say, keep staying consistent, your channel will grow. It just naturally will. And, and you gotta... The shoutouts, I feel like I'm helping somebody out. I'm helping a, a young YouTuber, as I like to say. A starter on YouTube. Whoa, I almost died right there. I'm, I'm helping a, a YouTuber getting his, um, getting shoutouts and stuff. I'm, I'm helping him get his name out there. Sorry for stuttering and not figuring out what I'm going to say before I say it. So, I'm going to start it off with this episode. First of all, I want to give a shoutout to... MC Zero to Hero. He's a big Minecraft guy. He's awesome, and he just recently um, had a recently reached 200 subscribers, and that's awesome for him. He had a um, 
he had a Roxio giveaway, and he does post some pretty good things, so subscribe to him. Another person who I want to um, comment is Sphere102. I know him personally, and you may have heard him from some of my other videos, and yeah, some of my other videos. He's an awesome YouTuber. I mean, he hasn't been posting a lot because he's been busy. I know him personally, but he's my friend, and, I, and, I, and we help each other out, even though he hasn't been much of a friend to me, you know, on YouTube. But, you know, I'll help my brother out, you know. Another shout out I want to give to is One Way Ticket 826. Now, he does a lot of COD, he does some Minecraft, and he does a lot of Battlefield 3. He was actually the reason why I wanted to get Battlefield 3, just because I see him play it, and I'm like, it's so much different than Call of Duty, and he makes a whole lot of points. So, shout out to him. And one more person I want to shout out to is, is um, Tortoise619. He used to record videos with an iPod 4th generation, and now he's recording with the Roxio. And let me tell you, I think he has uh, over 100 and. 20 subscribers I think I think 100 so check him out he's a pretty good youtuber and that concludes t this video hope you guys liked it rate you subscribe check out all the people I commented today and I'll see you guys on my next video